was. I was excited because I like doing di- things that are different. Mm. But then again, I like skydiving and falling over and stupid things. So mm-hmm. I like adrenaline. Yeah. I love roller coasters. I like... <laughs> I like those kinds of things, so I thought, why not? I don't think I'll die, so that's okay. My expectation was that it would be a lot harder and that I would fail miserably and not be able to get any anything adequate out of this, that I would look worse than I think I look. Well, that I, I would just look worse if it were possible. And But in actual fact, like it's been a fun thing. It, it's been a fun experience. I'm at ease. I didn't feel a need to perform beyond my abilities and it was very relaxing it was much more relaxing than I thought it would be I thought it would be actually rather taxing and difficult and I would have no idea and I'd frustrate everyone let's just say I didn't have a huge body of work or a report or something that I had to produce at the end of this it was actually a bit of fun it was a play it's fun to play and I don't actually play very much when you get older you don't play very much at all everything's rather serious and you've got a lot of responsibility so it was enjoyable playing such a shame isn't it women shouldn't have to feel so much pressure to be beautiful or desirable but unfortunately I think it's something we all have I have it I think most women have it and you really owe it to yourself to cultivate it because sometimes other people are not going to make you feel that wanted or celebrated and you'll be surprised how beautiful a person can really be because often you won't see it yourself and sometimes you need someone else to help you see it. Have you been photographed professionally in the last 10 years? No. Have you ever been? No. Never? Not that I'm aware. So today's the first day? I think so. Why did you choose to participate? That's a difficult question actually. It's more of a question of why not? Why on earth not? I'm only going to look worse every day after today. So I might as well just freeze what I can in time. (laughs) I guess that's a good way of seeing it. Yeah, yeah. Look, look, seriously, you're not going to be any hotter than you are now. It's all downhill. For everyone. Think about it. (laughs) What kind of feelings did you experience leading up to today? Apprehension, imposter syndrome, senses of inadequacy, that kind of thing. Because I'm not a model, I'm not, you know, I don't ever have my photo taken by choice. I'm the person that runs away from photos. I don't even have photos on my Instagram of myself. I don't take selfies, to give you an idea. Uh, I don't have body dysmorphia, but I don't put myself out there, if that makes sense. So I had a great deal of apprehension because I don't even know how to take a reasonable photo of myself and it was good though I think I've learned something <laughs> would you say you were excited yeah I was I was excited because I like doing di- things that are different mm. but then again I like skydiving and falling over and stupid things so I like adrenaline yeah. I love roller coasters I like <laughs> I like those kinds of things so I thought why not I don't think I'll die so that's okay <laughs> What were your expectations versus reality for this experience? It was, my expectation was that it would be a lot harder and that I would fail miserably and not be able to get any, anything adequate out of this, that I would look worse than I think I look, well that I, I would just look worse if it were possible and, but in actual fact, like it's been a fun thing, it, it's been a fun experience, I'm at ease, I didn't feel a need to perform beyond my abilities and it was very relaxing it was much more relaxing than I thought it would be I thought it would be actually rather taxing and difficult and I would have no idea and I'd frustrate everyone what was your favorite part of the day oh I love getting my hair done I've always liked getting my hair done but my favorite part of the day though really was just talking to people I like talking I like understanding who people are how they're traveling, what life is like for them. So I enjoy meeting people and you're all strangers to me. So it was interesting, you know, and, and that probably is the most cerebral enjoying thing about the day, you know, but in terms of actual pleasure and just enjoying it, 
it's strange to how could I put it let's just say I didn't have a huge body of work or a report or something that I had to produce at the end of this it was actually a bit of fun it was a play it's fun to play and I don't actually play very much when you get older you don't play very much at all everything's rather serious and you've got a lot of responsibility so it was enjoyable playing and has this photo shoot experience changed you I wonder um, let's see what the photographs look like and then I'll determine because I I have no reasonable photos of myself and oh, I've had some photos over the years would I consider it's changed my attitude to maybe getting some professional photos done because I probably do need some and for headshots and work and the like and that kind of thing. Um, it's changed my attitude to that. Yeah, but I don't know if it's made me more comfortable in my own skin. I wish that were true, but I think that's a huge journey and I don't expect anyone to be able to traverse that. <laughs> It's more, I think it's more of a mental thing that yeah. you have to develop over time. It is, but I'm running out of time. So it's <laughs> like, oh, when am I going to get over myself? And, and I have to figure that out. What would you say to all the women who are feeling like they want to experience this, but think they shouldn't? There's all, oh, I, oh I've got to be careful. Um, that's really upsetting because I think such a shame isn't it women shouldn't have to feel so much pressure to be beautiful or desirable but unfortunately I think it's something we all have I have it I think most women have it and you really owe it to yourself to cultivate it because sometimes other people are not going to make you feel that wanted or celebrated and you'll be surprised how beautiful a person can really be because often you won't see it yourself and sometimes you need someone else to help you see it. Thank you for coming today. Mm, thank you. It's a memorable experience. It is actually. It has been.